stupid. Hey guys, welcome back to our last little live spot here on Giving Zoo Day. I'm Keeper Mel. I'm one of the keepers and also the enrichment coordinator here at Elmwood Park Zoo. And down here, investigating the land of misfit toys I have, is our Jaguar Inca. We shifted her out here so we could talk about some of the things we need here for our Jaguars because they love to destroy nice things. So Inca, we're really hoping she's going to hop right up here because up here is a toy that they destroyed last year, um, that this is its last hurrah. We're hoping that she'll keep destroying it a little bit and then we're going to have to pull it from her. So that peg there is one of the heaviest duty plastic toys that this company makes. Um, and it lasted about three months with our Jaguars. Um, so also, this whole pile here that I have are all things they've destroyed in the last year or so. So for one reason or another, they have eaten part of it, put enough tooth holes in it, um, ripped, made it so bad that we had to cut it in half and then continued to chew on it. Um, that these are all things they can't have anymore or they can't have until we fix them. Um, so one of the things that we're asking for, for donations from our wish lists, are some new toys for our Jaguars. Um, we are happy to accept anything you guys would like to donate for the animals here. Um, there are some cheaper items on our wish lists, but these Jag toys can cost hundreds of dollars a piece. Um, and as you can see with Inca here, they really bring the cats a lot of joy. Um, so we love to give them new stuff, but financially, we need some help getting them some new stuff. Um, so Inca here is actually Keeper Kate's very favorite Jaguar. Um, so Kate, do you want to talk about Inca for a minute? Yeah, so Inca is absolutely my favorite Jaguar, and she's also the most destructive of our three Jaguars. So a lot of these damages are her fault and her daughter's. Uh, this keg that we have in there, once she when she throws it to the ground or tips it towards herself, you'll see how she kind of opens it up like a soup can. It's just pried open. Look how happy she is though. So let's give it back to her. Um, but she actually plays so rough with toys that she actually broke a tooth one time because that's what they do in nature. They're destructive. Um, they need to have strong, powerful jaws to be able to take down prey. So we like to enrich their lives by giving them strong, powerful toys that we hope that they would be able to destroy but she's uh, proven no match for some of the most heavy duty toys that we have here. But they make her so happy, so. They really do. Look how um, happy she is. <laughs> <laughs> so if you are interested, oh, there's a nice shot of what she broke last year, her and her daughter. Um, so you can also see on the label there, it says, is that one heavy duty? Or severe heavy duty? Yeah, they come in different levels of heavy duty. And we get the heaviest duty one we can in every toy. And there's still really no match for these jackets. And doesn't, looking at her now, it kind of reminds you of your house cat at home, right? When they get a toy and they kind of tackle it, and sometimes they'll flip over and kick it. I mean, they are just big cats, so this is what they do. Um, it's in their nature, and Inca is just especially good at it. Uh, she loves toys more than the other jaguars. They all love toys, but she especially loves toys. A lot of times we'll give her a pile of food, we're hidden around the exhibit, and then we'll give her toys and she'll go running straight for the toys. Um, her boyfriend, I guess we could say, Zian, yeah. um, husband maybe, they did have a daughter. Uh, they, he, his favorite toy is actually a keg, a full on beer keg. And then Luna's favorite toys, I would probably, probably say, this guy. yeah, this little spindle right here, she put a lot of <laughs> scratches in it and you can see the tooth marks there. But, we just love being able to enrich them because you can see it makes them happy, which makes us happy. Um, being able to create some diversity in their day is just, it's good for everyone. So we like to be able to change it up and offer them different things. And as you can tell, they appreciate it too. Yeah, so if you guys are interested in supporting us, supporting these cats, so they can have back toys that they just chew the tops out of so they can't have them anymore, um, you can go to our website, elmwoodparkzoo.org, and click on support, and there you can either donate to our annual funds, or you can find links to both our wish lists. So for big and small enrichment items for anybody we have here, or also some husbandry items. Um, and really we're happy for any, she does, any support you can give us, 
Makes us happy. Makes them happy. What do you want? She would like that square back. She would you like this one? <laughs> no, not, not that one. I think it's the big one. Or maybe it's the little one. It's this one. Which, as you can see, more tooth holes. Very popular, the tooth holes around here. Yeah, so these guys are just a little bit harder to enrich because they do have the strongest bite out of all the big cats. So they can do some serious damage to toys. They have extreme jaw pressure and muscle and it's just, it's crazy. All right, guys. Well, that's our time. Thank you very much for joining us all day today on um, Giving Zoo Day. We look forward to seeing you out here at the zoo. Say goodbye, Inca.